The Snow Monkey Park in Japan is located in an often snow-covered valley in a mountainous area surrounded by steep cliff and vast forest. The valley is filled with streams of natural hot springs. The park is famous in the world thanks to a special troop of wild monkeys named Japanese macacus, who enjoy bathing in hot springs in winter just as we do. After heavy snowfall and below freezing temperature in the past few days, the hot spring bath is filled with monkeys trying to stay warm. They are the only troop of monkeys in the world that display this unique and amazing behavior and therefore attract the visitors from all over the world. Here in their natural habitat, you can watch the monkeys relaxing and playing in the hot bath, grooming each other, nursing their babies, and running and jumping around in close proximity. Just like cats, monkeys usually don't like water and generally don't like getting wet. So you may wonder, how on earth the snow monkeys here started the behavior of bathing in the hot spring? It's all because of us. This is Hotel Kurakukan Onsen nearby. Back in the 60s, when the hotel guest was enjoying the outdoor onsen, the monkeys saw it and soon learned how joyful it is. They started jumping into the onsen, often sharing a little pool with the guests. For apparent sanitary reasons, this hot spring pool was built specially for the monkeys within their natural habitat. So this is their private bathtub. Accustomed to their human guests, they are not shy about being watched while taking the bath. Monkeys live in troops that consist of females, juveniles, and babies. 
among the 180 species of monkeys that exist today. The snow monkey, after several generations, became the only monkeys in the world known to enjoy bathing in hot springs. The snow monkeys here in the park belong to a single troop with about 160 members within their natural territory. Other troops of monkeys usually don't dare to enter the park and use their hot spring bath without paying a price. We pay the price to enter, but still cannot use their bath time. Females usually remain in their troop of birth for a lifetime, taking care of their babies and enjoy family time with their mothers and sisters. Where are the males? Once fully grown up, males will typically leave their troop of birth and jump from troop to troop looking for a girlfriend to start their own family. Otherwise, they would wander around by themselves lonely throughout their lives. Why does the monkeys enjoy soaking into the hot spring bath? Well, just think why we love taking the hot spring onsen in cold weather. For the snow monkeys, the primary reason is to survive the cold winter in the snow. So they are the only monkeys that can survive the extreme cold temperature in northern Japan. Baby monkeys and youngsters are more sensitive to the cold and they are often huddling together with their mother to keep warm. However, recent research shows that the monkeys also take the hot baths to relieve stress. And it's particularly helpful for a female's pregnancy. Interesting. The Japanese macaques are highly intelligent and social, with strong family bond, which is displayed and strengthened by constant grooming throughout the day every day. Grooming is important for social bond and skin hygiene. It's also an effective way to pick up parasites as a daily snack. Now let's relax and imagine yourself submerged in a hot spring onsen like this at freezing temperature in a snowy day. First time in Japan, it could be intimidating to take trains. Once you figure out how to take trains, it's straightforward to travel to the Snow Monkey Park. First, take the Shinkansen or the bullet train from Tokyo or other big city to Nagano Station. Then walk outside the station for 5 minutes to change to the local train, then take the line to Yudanaka Station. From there, take a local bus directly to the park or take a hotel shuttle to small towns near the park. After the entrance of the park is a 1.6 km pass through the forest to get to the bathing monkeys. The monkeys hot spring pool is small and can get very crowded during the day. For better viewing experience and photography opportunities, I recommend staying in the hotel overnight in a nearby town and visiting the park early morning right after it opens to beat the crowd of daily trippers. You can check out my video Shibu Onsen to see why staying overnight in this little onsen town nearby will remarkably enrich your cultural experience of Asian Japan. There are two sides of the pool we can take a photo from. 
The one on the left is above the pool, good for taking an overview of the pool and the monkey groups. The one on the right is lower than the pool, an ideal place for photos with eye-to-eye -eye contact at the same level, a basic principle in wildlife photography. The snow monkey is unique, fascinating to watch, and a rare subject in wildlife photography. Only after soaking into the hot onsen yourself in snowy sub-freezing conditions can one truly appreciate the feeling and enjoyment the monkey has. This is an amazing experience you don't want to miss while traveling in Japan.